By the late 1960s, job-related accidents accounted for more than 14,000 worker deaths annually. In addition, nearly two and a half million workers were disabled every year. Congress recognized that safety and health conditions needed improvement. So on December 29, 1970, the Occupational Safety and Health Act was passed. The act was the culmination of years of evolution. It was to establish a federal program with an opportunity for state participation to assure a level of safety and health for all employees. In passing the Occupational Safety and Health Act, Congress created three new agencies. First, it established OSHA itself within the Department of Labor to set and enforce job safety and health standards. Second, the OSHA Act created NIOSH, the National Institute for Occupational Safety and Health, to conduct occupational safety and health research. NIOSH, an agency in the Department of Health and Human Services, also is mandated to do long-term safety and health educational programs. The third and last organization established by the OSH Act was the Occupational Safety and Health Review Commission. The commission is an independent quasi-judicial agency that reviews employers' contests of OSHA enforcement actions.